as they go there for the Finland uh, this is the just they just concluded a convention that took place in Finland uh, and Melano <laughs> well uh, our own not today watch and today bring you information of everything uh, will be say they happen because for this channel uh, not to bring you the correct information will be say you need and the things uh, where you want to see because information is power information is key information is paramount <laughs> as they go this is the finland convention that, that uh, the prime minister of the biafra republic government in exile just hosted according to him uh, that this is going to engender the exit of Ni uh, biafrans uh, from nigeria uh, from the comment he made the other time he said that uh, he will be in finland and achieve biafra freedom that is what he said. I think I also uh, showed you that video where he said that he will be in Finland and achieve the Biafra freedom or the Biafra referendum. How he's going to do that, I don't know. There was a time in his Twitter handle he started listing, uh, he listed list of countries that got, uh, that were uh, nations in exile uh, before they got their 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 freedom oh, many many countries even in the soviet union and the rest of them who did that and at the end of everything the freedom is gotten and so as go go danya setin yo se yo ta go so as it be uh, the convention uh, i think um has ended uh, it is a 3 days one or should be ending today it is a 3 days convention and this part i showed you is uh, the best moment of that uh, convention if i am easy uh, as na onye si not this eh nya bia me gene nya bia me but looking at the, the dignitary, uh, dignitaries that you know um you know that appeared in that epoch event, I, I think um it, it's telling a story. It's a kind of handwriting on the wall that is saying something. Uh, you know, the first time we saw the handwriting on, on the wall was the time of um uh, 
uh, one of the sons of Nebuchadnezzar, Belteshazzar, uh, a man who drank with the holy cup of the Almighty, the God Almighty, and he received that finger handwriting on the wall that nobody in, uh, in Babylon could interpret those days. And um, they started calling men until people like Daniel, who had the wisdom of the Almighty, were able to interpret that handwriting and say, Mene, mene, tekel, apazon. He said, look, your kingdom has been taken away from you. And I think um, it could be a handwriting that uh, the kingdom is being taken away from Ogatinu Bruce. I don't really know, but this is what I am seeing. I'm trying to forecast the future, to go into the future and see what is going to happen, whether the long-awaited Biafra freedom and referendum is going to take place in this Tinubu regime. I think if that happens, I think um, Tinubu will we be in two sides of history. Number one is that he was once the president of Nigeria. And second history is that he was the president in office when Nigeria, when uh, Biafra got their ref referendum and independent. I think this is the two sides of history that is going to be facing Tinubu as he will be in office. Uh, because looking at the handwriting of, on the wall, looking at the kind of calibers of people, uh, that uh, uh, came into that occasion, that graced that occasion. It will, it will tell you a story. You don't need to be told. Just uh, I know you saw the video, you watched the video, and you saw what is happening. I want you to go down to the comment section, drop your comment. Uh, let's see, what do you think? What do you feel? What do you think about what is currently going on in Finland? What do you think about Biafra agitation? What do you think about what Simon Epa is doing? Do you think that he is going to make it, or whether he's not going to make it? Please just drop your comment on this comment section and I will be glad to respond to your comment. And if this is your first time of joining us on this wonderful channel, kindly go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, share. And also remember to on your notification button so that whenever our news is dropping, you will be the first to collect it. Thank you for listening. God bless you, my wonderful people.